y'all. I am here today to take a moment to teach you how to batch edit in Photo Room. Photo Room is by far my favorite app to use as a reseller. So I, I talk about it all the time and I want to do some tutorials teaching people why I love it so much. So I'm going to start by sharing my screen. This is my phone screen, which is what I wanted to share with you because it is what I use pretty much all the time for photo room. So I'm going to start and stop and kind of show you how this works. What I did was recorded my screenshot. I open up photo room and down at the bottom, I hit batch mode. And then I go through and select the photos and I will go through and literally quick scroll all the way up to the top of all the photos that I have that I want to remove the background from. I like to remove it from all of my items and I like the white background. I don't play around with all the fancy things. So as you see now, it's going through and it's automatically removing the backgrounds. And I just kind of scroll up as it goes through the process because there's always going to be a glitch, something that happens that I need to fix. So I'm going to show you how to, okay, point in case, this picture took out more than I wanted it to. Click on the picture, edit cutout, and then restore, and you touch it, and it restores what was erased that you didn't want. So I just hit next and go through, oop, the top of the mannequin needs restoring. Click the picture, hit the edit, hit restore, tap it, and boom, it's done. So then I go through, and I these are a little yellow. That's going to be another video. Oh, look down there. There's something I didn't want. So I click on it, hit erase, touch it, and it takes it away. And then I just go through. And again, some of these pictures have a yellow hue, which I will do another thing on how to fix that simply. So I go through, look at all the pictures and make sure everything is as I want it as far as the background removal goes. And as you can see, there were only a few that I needed to fix. Everything really came out clear. As you saw in the beginning, I did not do any special white backgrounds. So now that it's done, I hit export images and then I save images to my photo room. It is done. And then I'm gonna show you how I go to my photos, pop them open, open up my recents and there they are. And then I automatically go up and I take all the ones with the backgrounds, the original photos, and I swipe up and I just delete them and get them out of there because I can't stand all the photos I have and I have thousands. Um, so here I have it. Next thing I will show you on another video will be how I change the coloring of something if I'm not happy with the tone and color. I hope this helped. And uh, yeah, I hope this is something that you guys all understand. And I am happy to help in any way I can in the future. Please go to consignmentchats.com. You can hook up with us in all the places that we are. We love helping resellers, and giving you information that will help you. So if there's any other tutorials you're interested in, just leave them in the comments below and we will be happy to help you out with that. Thanks and y'all have a good day.